Hey guys, it's CJ from SmartKPI.com. We're here at Sony Ericsson's booth at CTIA 2011, and we're checking out on Verizon uh, Sony Xperia Play. Yeah. So what we have here, just like you said, is the Verizon the Sony X Sony Ericsson Xperia Play. As you can see, it does run on Android 2.3. Very very smooth operating system. Great smartphone. Um, it has all the applications available on here, plus all the Verizon apps as well. And also, the great thing about this device it has a 5 megapixel camera with the photo light as well as a VGA camera right on the front of the device. Um, it's everything that you need in a smartphone but also everything that you want in a gaming device. So as soon as you open up the slide out keyboard, the first thing you'll notice is that the PlayStation keyboard on there. It's a world's first PlayStation certified handset with the D-pad, X square, circle, triangle buttons as well as the select and start. We also have the shoulder bumper pads on the back here, the L and the R buttons as well as the touch analog joysticks. Six games will be available at launch with this device. Asphalt 6 Adrenaline, Bruce Lee Dragon Warrior, classic game for PS1, which is Crash Bandicoot, uh, Star Battalion, Sims 3, as well as Tetris. Um, you can also download more games at launch. There will be over 50 games available at launch uh, with this device that are all PlayStation certified. You can also go on the Android market and download many games as well. You want to see the gameplay as soon as you slide it open again. It goes right into gaming. We'll choose Asphalt 6 here. It's great. You know, it's not, is this new now? Yeah, it's new now. Let's try it again. Okay. And um, it should be out, you know, it's Q2, so it's great to see. No worries. So yeah, it's a great here. Fantastic, it looks beautiful. Thank you. So you can see the graphics are really good. What you'll notice is that the graphics don't lag at all. It's very, very sharp, grid images. Um, it's got a one gigahertz processor, processor Snapdragon engine, which is dual channel, one channel specifically for the, the phone, one channel specifically for the GPU for the games. So even if you're downloading a, a big file for your emails, you can still play games very, very smoothly. Just to get into gameplay here. So you have gas, brake, change view, the back R, R1 and R, L, R and L shoulder buttons are your turbo buttons. Change the view here. So you can use the directional keypad for uh, the control of the vehicle or you can use the analog joystick as well to get more precision. And turbo. That's pretty much it.